Pretty cool. Look at you dropping in all classy. Yeah, getting ready for my hike. Y'all sitting around you fiddling dicks. My hair's naturally curly. Oh, <laughs> fiddling dicks. We're all in here goddamn working. Natalie's about to get life going. Designing a tattoo. Board? Boomtown. Hi. Still a little chilly, rainy. Um, but I gotta get outside. Matt and Nick are working, and I'm not working on this trip, so I wanted to get out and have some fun. And here's my crew. Yeah. So I'm staying right here. <laughs> it's misting, but it's not bad. And it's not that cold. You get used to it. Right? It's not bad at all. It feels good. Okay, so we're about to head downtown. A little bit of work done by everyone. And uh, on with the day. I think we're gonna escape Reykjavik. Yeah, baby, you, you fucking, you did great. Give Matt a heads up then about where he needs to stop because he may not be able to see it. They say, lights, all the lights. Yeah, I'm going to show you the lights. So that's the fun, is figuring the lights. I like that out there. Oh, that's so cool. The, the lights. Yeah. The lights. Oh, where the so, switches are. Like the bathroom lights outside of here. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, they can and, switch us on. Yeah, here you go. So here's like really here's some, some, some video material yeah. for that ass. So, yeah, me trying to turn the lights on in the bathroom. Yeah, but who watches the watchman? I couldn't figure it out because it was out there. We do. We have the men of the night's watch at this house. So, it's beautiful. Yes. Different world, though. So this is like a shoehorn. Huh? Oh, is it? It's it's cool. 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 What? That's a bed? Yeah, real boots. No, it goes wraps around. Holy fuck. Real this staircase is sick. Yeah. This everything is sick. This is rad. Yeah. It's cool. It's all like... Yeah. 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 Yeah.
one did you get? Thank you, Harold. Yeah. Have you tried it yet? No. She's just, Chloe brought that up recently and she still denied. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Uh, of the month with extra meat. Dracula. Um, it's got all those hunks in it. Yeah. <laughs> Blazing Saddles. It's a lunchtime fair. Full destruction. Really my We're going to head back to the house, grab up Nick Valley, and get out of town. Like TLC said, we're going to go chase waterfalls. Make a U-turn. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, you don't know me. Fast knife. So we are leaving Reykjavik. We are gonna head that way to Gulfoss and Geyser. Check out two of the cooler things, and I'm kind of worried on the way back we may run out of time to go see. And since uh, it's Sunday and it's daylight outside. <laughs> We can go. We're gonna go check it out. So we got like an hour, hour and a half drive, and uh, should be rad. It's one of the, it's a fucking geyser. It goes off all the time. It's gonna be rad. So we're gonna go ahead and hit the road and make this go. While we were downtown, uh, we passed this rainbow colored building and me, a man who's not afraid to kiss another man, decided to give old Ben a nice smooch on the lips. I also knew he wouldn't be able to escape me or my musk. And, um, got it. Honoring Pride Day. And, uh, it is. Honoring Pride Day in the name of my gay friends. I'm gonna kiss another man. Kiss another man. My wife was there. She supported it. I had to hold her hand right after. She did. She had to put the get the gay off of me. <laughs> no. She had to pray the gay away, if you will. <laughs> um, I sent that picture over to Beach, and uh, he responded with, "We need to do shirts that say Kiss Today and the Dude.' Let me know what you think down there. Maybe we do some pride shirts and uh, do some charity stuff and do a Kiss Today and the Dude shirt. Take this <laughs> Which makes me really happy. <laughs> we may be running low on fuel." I don't think like dangerously low on fuel, but we're running low on fuel. Let me check on B team. What's your fuel gauge look like? Um, full. We got a quarter. Woo! Woo! What'd you get there? Ten. What's that? Ten bro. Maybe not. It's a tenth of a penny. Like I think Ping Villa or something like that. The word I can't pronounce. That's where we're at. And uh, on our way to Kaiser and still in search of gas, but we're still fucking off. I think we found a gas station. And shouldn't die. I think we're good. We we're won't be stranded. We're almost out of the national park, so things will be looking up after that for gas. <laughs> Information. There's a couple. Look, there's a big town coming up around here. Big town. Look all those streets coming off of it. That's our spot. Entire video, so only his ponytails part. blurred Matter out. Matter of fact, all the warriors of all time all had fucking long hair. Strange. Because they didn't live in a fucking goddamn time with scissors. They also didn't fucking hang out in the air conditioner. I'm a big goddamn fan of that and leather seats. It's, you're not a warrior. You're fucking not a warrior. <laughs> you impede? How was it? 
Refreshing? We're here, guys. Here, we got the squad. We're gonna go check Earth water. It's gonna shoot out, fly into the sky. It's nine fifteen. Since I've been here a couple times, uh, it's the way geysers work, right? Because there's underground rivers and there's underground lava, and they get. <laughs> they mix. They mix, but lava lava works like works like oil compared to water. It rides on top. And let's be honest, those two things don't miss. Boils a bit. And then after it gets its juices flowing, it goes gnarly up vertical. And then it's got to rest for like 10 to 15 minutes before it can reload. Everyone knows that's the situation. These fucking maniacs. Any warmer, and so hey, Nick, <laughs> you feeling warm, cozy? No, perfect. Last last stop of tonight's exhibition expedition, Gulf Foss, possibly night. Be prepared, be prepared. <laughs> Go see a waterfall. Hey, everyone, have a buddy. Being you're flying solo, and I want you to know it's fucking dangerous. It's in West Memphis. West, West, West Memphis. You know, out there in Cape Girardeau. Oh shit. Yeah, it's not that big. God damn! Oh, it's a big bitch. It's so big. Okay, done, sir. here in Iceland is a really big one. It's like Niagara. So it just moves a shit ton of water off of like two pretty good drops. And for a country that's only the size of my state, Iceland does a real good job of making me feel super fucking small and insignificant. It's probably why it's good here, why the people are so pretty normal. I like it. That was, a, that was a full day. We managed some stuff downtown, made our way out into the country. Kind of a little, little taste for the rest of the group. Tired of seeing buildings and people and uh, a little bit more of what Iceland's known for. So we're going to punch out, call it a day, spread hate, always party. Um, 
I'm gonna walk up a bunch of stairs now. to mid-sized apparel company. Your crew comes to the rescue. Psych on them stairs, son. <laughs> gotcha, Iceland. Ha, ha, ha.